Hi guys, welcome back to the La Nation channel. Uh, the video I'm making today is to share with you uh, how I accomplished to this uh, uh, fancy emulator or this nice looking Android emulator uh, skin. So uh, I've uh, done some research uh, and then I uh, came across this and uh, it looks better to have my Android emulator uh, looking this way than the older uh, default one provided by uh, Google. So I will show you this, the, the steps I took to get to this uh, type of skin. So to be uh, quick, I will close uh, this window. Then I'm going to, uh, let me close the, uh, this one as well. I will go to the internet and then type the link that you're going to find on the description of this video. The first link, this will be the one I will put here and then I will click, I will open it. It's going to download a zip file for me. So I'm going to go to the directory where that zip file is, uh, con uh, is found. Then I will take that file. Then uh, I will go to my Android installation folder. You should know where your Android is installed. So mine is on the local disk C under Android dev and then the folder is called Android SDK Windows. So I will go there inside my Android installation uh, folder as you see here Android SDK Windows. I will look for a folder called platforms. Then inside the platform you have your Android and the version number. Those are the, the version that you're going to have when you're creating your uh, virtual machine. So for instance if you want to use this uh, skin on the when you create the the version 8 or 9 let's say you only work on 7 8 and 9 you have to do the step that I'm going to show you to each of this so that it affects the, the, the specific version that you want to use I will use uh, version 8 so I'm going to go to the version to the Android 8 uh, folder and then I will look for the folder called skins there I will paste the file we just downloaded So I'm going to paste that file there. Then I will extract the files inside the file. So I will extract them. As you can see, after extracting this uh, this uh, files, I'm just going to get rid of this zip folder because I don't I don't need it anymore. Um, inside there, you have uh, like four. Um, folders those are the skins that you're going to have so we're going to take those four folders and then we're going to uh, return to the skins folder because this is the folder created after zipping so we return to the skins and then we're going to paste our folders there because uh, the folder that you see here are the fold are the option that you're going to see when you're creating uh, on the when you create your virtual machine so this one is the empty because we just uh, removed the four folder we have so this one is empty so we going we can delete it so we don't gonna we're not gonna need it so we're gonna be left with this uh so this will be the option we're going to see on uh, when creating the virtual machine so what we're going to do now we're going to go back on uh, in and uh, in, in eclipse and then in eclipse we're going to go to uh on the on the on our eclipse menu we're going to go to the windows and then we go to android sdk avd manager then on in the android sdk and avd manager we're going to create a new virtual machine uh, to just uh, keep it clean uh, i will click on new then here i will give it a name let me see i will let me say i will call it test uh, youtube that's the virtual machine that we're going to create. The target, remember, we use the eight uh, Android eight eight folder uh, there. So we go. It's going to work on the eight on the level eight. So we're going to take this one on the API level eight for Android two point two. Uh, so after doing that, we're going to give it SD uh, card. We're going to give it Android, and then here. This is uh, where we, we've done our changes on the built-in skin. So as you can see now, you can see here, we have more option than the normal that you, the default that you have. So we uh, will choose this uh, Nexus one black. Then after selecting that, uh, we just going to click on the button, create AVD. 
So it's gonna create a new um, a virtual machine for us. So as you can see here, the one that we just created is it's here. It's this YouTube um, um, uh, you test YouTube. So we're going to do one more step before we launch this because this the screen has been created for big presentation on the big screens or the screens with uh, the the large screen. So we need to uh, scale it to a lower. Um, to a low, to 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 work on our uh, normal um, notebooks uh, on small um, monitors, or you know, for instance, like let me say, I will scale mine on zero point six. You can scale it on zero point five if you want it up, because these skins are very big. But uh, zero point six, they really uh, they work for me, you know. So I will select that, and then uh, we'll select it first, and then I will. Uh, start it you know and then as you see usually on this uh, we we have this window when uh, before we launch the emulator so this time what we're going to do on this window as you can see the skin name is there we're just going to click on scale uh, display to real size so this depend on, on your monitor mine is going to work on the, let me say I'm happy with uh, six so I'm going to have a scale uh, six. So from here, we can uh, launch our skin. As you can see, my our emulator starting. So we having uh, this emulator with the new and better looking um, uh, skin. So I guess uh, after running this for the first time, when you're going to close this, the preference uh, the preferences will be kept but uh, if uh, it's not just make sure when you uh, uh, when it when, before you launch the emulator that uh, you have to scale it to the size of your screen because mine it uh, it's like one one thousand three hundred something by uh, seven hundred and so, uh, six sixty or something that's uh, the resolution that I have here so uh, I will uh, advise you guys to uh, play around with it that way if yeah, you have like a smaller monitor so this is uh, what I had to show you in case um, you guys um, want to work on uh, much more uh, on a better looking uh, Android um, more, uh, emulator as you can see mine at the moment. So I will just ask you uh, if you will have questions or if you have any problem uh, when uh, doing this. Uh, uh, you just have to leave a comment then I will see if I have uh, any input to give you I will give you or other guys I will do the same so it's taking a bit of while because this is the first time I'm creating this emulator uh, but uh, the next time is going to uh, be faster than that and then this anyway so as you can see this is my Android emulator so I uh, have at least a better looking one at the moment so if you like this video please uh, click on uh, click uh, give me a thumb up or and uh, subscribe if you want to uh, get updated with whatever i found and i want to share with you guys so i will say uh, goodbye here that was de la nation au revoir